Yum. Mmm. It's a rainy day in Florence today. I just went to the Afuzi Gallery. It was insane. I'm currently just walking back to my hostel. I spent about two to three hours there. Um, I'm passing by the Duomo. It's so insane walking around these streets. It's nothing like I've ever seen before. And just to have the Duomo just like right there, so easily accessible. So insane. So I'm currently on the roof right now, which is so beautiful and so sunny. The weather's been so good for a couple of rainy days. The view up here is insane. That's the Duomo, which is so crazy and that you can see all of the roofs of all the Florentine houses. It's so nice to sit up here and read, write, paint, draw, yeah. I will say I am a little bit upset because I knew the film was going to be expensive here. Spent a fortune on this roll and then I had it in my bag when I went to the um, Afuzi gallery yesterday and I didn't realize that they would have airport security scanners to go in. And so this went through the security scanner and I didn't even remember that it was in there. So I'm really hoping that it still works and that it hasn't fully ruined my film.
need to check the feet. Florence, Italy, you have my heart. These streets were so special. Unlike anything I've seen before, they were so old and rich with history. The sun that shone in Italy was so warm. Unlike any other European sun, I found that the colors of the buildings, the rich oranges and yellows contrasting the blue of the sky just really emphasized the warmth of Italy even in the winter. I found the people were so loud, busy, eccentric. We ate rich and delicious and simple foods and we drank Cheers. and had such a good time sitting in the park, drawing. Florence is a place that I'll never forget. Oh my golly. They're so cool, look. Wow, they're like acorns. They are acorns. Oh, are they actually? Probably. I'll never forget the feeling of walking down the streets, tiny little alleyways, and the stunning Duomo that we often passed and stared in wonder at. Thank you, Florence. As I'm packing from Florence, I've just gone through all of the postcards that I've collected so far in my month of travels, and you can really tell where my inspirations are. Van Gogh. I've got two Caravaggios from two different museums. And two different Botticellis from two different museums. So I'm picking up all the same artists as my kind of favorites from the galleries but yeah you can really just tell like what I'm inspired by <laughs> 